you open your damn eyes? Hey, you can't be a fucking oh, no. prick like that! Mr. MacWright presents how to play Windows games on Mac via Boot Camp. Boot Camp allows an Intel-based Mac to drill boot into Windows. This gives you the option to boot into Mac or Windows when you turn on the computer. Alright, let's get to it. Step 1. Getting prepared. To start off with, you'll need an Intel-based Mac and a 16GB or larger USB flash drive. If you have a recent Mac from 2015 onwards, you may not require a USB for installation. Next, make sure your software and bootcamp assistant are up to date, and check that Windows 10 actually supports your model. According to Apple, for the method shown in this video, you will need a Mac model from 2012 onwards. Check the description for a full list of supported Macs. And last, be sure to unplug any external devices from your Mac. Apart from the USB for installation. Step 2. Getting the Windows 10 disk image. Microsoft offers a Windows 10 ISO for free. However, this isn't the full version, and you will eventually need to buy a Windows 10 license key for around $120. There is a link in the description if you want to buy it. To find the ISO, search on Google Windows 10 ISO. Otherwise, click the download link in the video description. From here, choose Windows 10 Home Edition, select your product language, and click Confirm. Now you must choose which Windows version you want. The 64-bit option is for new Mac models, and the 32-bit option is for older models. I suggest going with the 64-bit option. Once the download has completed, go to Spotlight Search and look for Boot Camp Assistant. Step 3. Using Boot Camp Assistant. From the Boot Camp menu, click Continue. If you have an older Mac, you may see an option to check three boxes. Create a Windows 8 or later install disk, download the latest Windows support software, and install Windows 8 or later. Go ahead and check these boxes. Otherwise, for newer models, this page may not exist. Click continue and find the Windows 10 ISO from the downloads folder. If you have a USB inserted, you can use it as an install disk destination. Otherwise, if you have a recent Mac, the destination will automatically be your internal drive, which means you don't need a USB. Decide your partition size. This part is up to you. However, you need to keep in mind, Windows needs at least 20 gigabytes for installation, and you cannot change the partition size later. Once you've decided, click Install. Bootcamp will ask you to enter in your password, so go ahead and do so. The install process can take a while. Be sure not to quit the installation, as it can have huge negative effects on your Mac. Bootcamp will ask you to enter a password and will restart. Step 4. Installing Windows 10. After your Mac has restarted, you'll be taken to the Windows 10 install setup. Choose your language information and click install. If you don't have a Windows product key, don't worry. You can click I don't have a product key and can activate later. Now choose Windows 10 Home and agree to the license terms. From here, choose custom install Windows only and click the boot camp partition or the last partition on the list. If you get confused, you're looking for the partition you allocated space for. Now it's time to format the partition, click next, and wait for Windows 10 to install on your computer. After it has completed, you'll be asked to enter in your personal information. Just follow the easy steps until Windows gets the desktop ready for you. Step 5. Using the Bootcamp Installer You should now be on the Windows desktop and see the Bootcamp Installer. Be sure to complete this, as it installs important drivers on your Mac. If you can't find it, open OS X Reserved or find the USB drive under this PC. If you want to choose which operating system to boot into when starting your Mac, hold Alt when turning on your Mac. 
If you want your Mac to automatically boot into either Windows 10 or Mac OS, simply go down to the Boot Camp control panel. Step six, gaming on Windows 10. You can now enjoy Windows 10, and most importantly, a wider catalog of amazing games. Windows is better for gaming than Mac OS in many ways. So depending on your Mac model, you should get an increase in performance. Some of the best places to get games are Steam, Origin, Battle.net, and Epic Games. And there we have it, how to play Windows games on Mac via Boot Camp. If you have any issues with installing Windows or playing games, I'm here to help. Remember, all download links are in the description. Also, if you're interested, I have another tutorial on how to install Windows 10 via Parallels 12. The link is in the video description. Thank you guys so much for watching, and as always, please leave a like, subscribe, and consider supporting me on Patreon. Have a good one, guys. Yeah. See, must be the thing to do. <laughs> no! No! Was it me? <laughs> <laughs> GG!